just to keep methodically going down your checklist of things that need to be done. If, if when you're finally sitting down to write your grant narrative and go through your objectives and goals and how you're going to be doing things, you want to have a draft by the 28th. You want to have that reviewed by the 29th. You want to have another draft by the 1st. And then you have your final date where you're going to be kicking it out the door and you're going to be submitting it. All of these things, you want to have all of that spelled out so you're meeting these steps in time. Because if even if you have a month to write a grant proposal, that goes so quickly. And if you're not meeting these little steps, these hundred little things that need to be done along the way, then you're setting yourself behind or you're falling at risk of not submitting on time. And there's no excuse for that. 